Hi guys, my name is Antonius Vizidinis from Efodio Road and in this video I will show you the easy way to install the necessary software for Android development. First we have to open Google and write Android SDK. From this link we want to... OK, we are here. You can see here that it says uh, with a single download the ADT battle includes, this is a new one, everything you need to begin developing apps. Eclipse, ADT plugin, Android SDK tools, Android platform tools, the latest Android platform, the latest Android system image for the emulator. Download the SDK, ADT battle for Windows from here. I click and now we have to accept the terms and conditions uh, down here. We have to select 32-bit uh, or 64-bit, uh, depends on the computer that we have. And uh, download the SDK the bundle for the Windows. We click, the zip file start to downloading, as you see here. When the download finish, we can click here to open all the downloaded uh, files. And then you can see here that the file that we want, the file that we want, uh, we can open the folder that contains this file. Select the file, right click and uh, copy. We can make a, a new folder in uh, the, our local disk. I have already created one and I name it uh, apps. You can uh, go with right click and create your own uh, folder. And then paste the, the file in the folder. I have already done it and this is our uh, zipped file. Then we have to extract the file. Right click again. Extract the file as you wish, and uh, we will. You will. You will have this uh, folder, who contains another folder, and in this folder we have uh, Eclipse folder, SDK folder, and the SDK manager. We will see what, uh, how we can uh, use them after we finish the installation. Double click to Eclipse folder and then double click to Eclipse uh, application. You might have problem with uh, Java if you have a new computer or your Java is not uh, installed correctly. If you have a problem with Java you can go again to Google. You have to download the Java. Uh, you can write uh, Java SE Java SE downloads. Click on the link. From here we want the JDK JDK download. It's all that we need. All tools that we need and all tools that uh, any programmer needs to to create an application in Java. Then we have to accept the agreement the license agreement here and select the right uh, file to start the downloading the right executable file from here I will select Windows 64 du uh, click that just click the file and it start to downloading again when the download finished you know the way we open uh, the folder I have already done the download you can do you can wait to for the file to download for you. I will pause or cancel this download. This is the file that we want. You can open the folder that contains the file. Copy the file again as we done it before and paste it to our local disk in our folder here. run the file and uh, follow the steps and then automatically 
will uh, the Java install all the necessary components on your computer. When uh, the installation complete, then you can go again to the folder that contains the Eclipse and uh, double click to the Eclipse to open Android Developer Tools. As you see here, we need to select a workspace uh, for uh, our application. We can uh, select our uh, workspace from here or we can create a new one with Browse. We will use this uh, for now, this workspace. The workspace uh, contains all the necessary files for us to and for our application. We'll see it later. When you start the, the Eclipse, you will see a start, uh, a start page. You can close the start page and then you will be like me. You have the same uh, view as I have. Thank you for listening to this uh, lesson. I hope you see you again to the next one.